really like to give them back to someone. Yeah, by that comment, I'm guessing I'm on the right track. I'm thinking he's either going to jump out of the window and handcuff him, or drop them on his head. This needs a direct hit. <laughs> drop them on his head. <laughs> you can keep them, Dandy. Dandy. That's hilarious. You deserved it, you bastard. Right. Get out of here. He deserves much more, but I don't want to soil my hands. Can I rob him? You shouldn't have taken what doesn't belong to you, you bastard. I'm taking this back. And what's this? So you find my cap as well? Thanks a lot. Cheers, filthy scum. We have a hat and we have a medallion. Let's go. Brian's waiting for me in a pub. What was its name? I don't know. Oh, perhaps we can ask the laundress. Though apparently she's a silly cow, so... Nope, she knows nothing. Brian's waiting. I know, you told me. Just leave. I couldn't find a better hiding place. Hmm. I still don't understand why it uh, has onto the roof over there. Um, He deserves Yeah, I know. The best thing is that he won't have the slightest idea who smashed him like this. I hope I didn't kill the fella. There are bloodstains visible closer. I think a fatal bench. The bench of death. Staircase. I don't yeah. think so. Yeah. Apparently he does not think so. Dead end. Shit. I'd rather avoid the docks like the plague. Seawater doesn't fit with me. Hmm. Let's try going up on the roof. Just for, you know, giggles. I'm determined at some point you have to go up on this roof. Nothing's happening, so No. Tim, I'm starting to hate you. Hmm, I don't quite understand where I'm supposed to go. Mm, must be something to do with these items I picked up. This is the only thing that's left of my parents. I almost gave up hope of getting it back. Ah! Oh, what a relief. Brian's letter is here. It was a brilliant idea to sew it into the lining. Brilliant idea, my man. Dear Tim, you know writing is not my strong point, so I'll get right to the subject. You were right. Leaving Longery wasn't a good idea. I miss the old times and I'm in a bit of trouble. When we last met, you talked about America. I thought you were insane, but I've changed my mind. You're just a fool. Who let me leave. But if you still mean it seriously, I'm coming with you. I can't miss the crack. You sly fox. There'll be women everywhere. Today is the 28th of October, 1894. 
In precisely three weeks, a boat leaves for the new world. And we'll be on it. You can find me every evening, sitting in a pub called The Salted Cheek. Don't make me wait too long. Good luck, and come quickly, Tim. You know I'm not patient. Brian. The salted cheek. Sounds dirty. The salted butt cheek. Okay, let's go. A pub called the Salted Cheek. I wonder where it is. Oh, god damn it, we can't go yet. i to ask the laundress. Do you know a pub called the Salted Cheek? It's such a strange name. I'm to meet someone there, but I don't know where it is. Stupid me. I could have predicted what you'll turn out to be. Uh, what? I'm afraid I don't understand. Don't play the innocent. It's the most popular whorehouse in town. But what's the big deal? Nothing has happened. Do men ever think of anything other than loose women? Oh, you make me sick. But it's not like that. I just have to meet my friend there. It was his idea, not mine. Go and meet whoever you like, but don't come back here again. Take the main road up to St. Patrick's Square, turn left, and then take the third street on the right. You can't get lost. You can smell it for miles. Oh, don't be mad, Emily. It's laughable. Sure. You've really made me laugh. Now get out. What's, What's come, come over her? her? I just, I just can't, can't understand, understand women. women. She told you. Let's not go back there. She's a very angry woman. Oh, this reminds me of the Sherlock Holmes games. Funeral of the White Beast. The number of protests is increasing over the funeral of Sir William in the graveyard, where the victims of his supposed murders lie. Police precautions and reinforced patrols are expected. The death of the White Beast is widely regarded as a divine intervention. But some people are afraid that he has not left the game yet. The request for immediate cremation of his body was vigorously rejected. According to traditions, Sir William will be buried in the family tomb. God save the Queen and all of us. The White Beast. Eek. Exactly according to Brian's taste. I bet the door leads to a whorehouse. Now it's obvious why Emily got angry. Hey, milk sop. Do we know each other? I don't think so. But I was waiting for someone like you. Because today is your lucky day, pal. You're telling me. So, what do you want? Dice. The best of games. And you're the lucky one who's going to play with me. What's lucky about being fleeced for my last penny? <laughs> think it over. It's up to you. But if you refuse... I don't give second chances. What'll he do if I refuse? Stab a knife in my back? Um, screw it. I know at least two better ways to spend my hard-earned cash. Anybody can get boozed and go around with hookers. Yeah, exactly. I would just swap the order. As you wish, peasant. But when the tramps fleece ya, don't come back. I'm telling you straight out, it's your last chance. No thanks. Dice are nothing for me. Pity. At least I know what kind of a man you are. Me too. You can be sure. The pub. The salted cheek. I'd expect something like the sea wolf, but 
The salted cheek isn't.